Hello, I'm Ipek. Uh, and I'm Burcu. And today we are going to talk about water pollution in Turkey. Uh, why did we choose this subject? Uh, because water pollution, as we will talk about later on, uh, is statistically biggest present environmental problem in Turkey. Uh, since we live in a city in which sea plays a vital role, uh, we thought that we should talk about this. Uh, water pollution is contamination of water bodies, such as uh, lakes, rivers, oceans, aquifers and groundwaters. Uh, and it occurs when pollutants uh, are discharged into water without uh, adequate treatment to remove harmful compounds. Uh, it affects plants and organisms living in these bodies of water. Uh, in almost all cases, the effect is damaging uh, natural bio biological communities. And the pack will continue. Uh, uh, as my partner Burjo mentioned, that water pollution is a big problem in whole world. Like, see, uh, one of the six persons in the planet doesn't have access to a clean water source. So, uh, also in Turkey, it's a big problem. And anywhere in the world, the urbanization is the cause. And uh, one of the biggest uh, harmful, uh, harmful to uh, water pollution. The place is the factories. Uh, factories uh, pollute the uh, water the most, and the pesticides and uh, the uh, old agricultural chemical manure the, does very huge damage to the water sources, to our water sources. And the amount of factories, they can say that the pest factories which produce pesticide is the, the biggest problem. Uh, for water, water pollution, uh, there is not just one or two reasons, there are many reasons and we can name many of them for cities. For example, as you can see in this chart, uh, water pollution in cities caused by domestic waste the most and the insufficient sewerage and the partial treatment, uh, refinement and the pesticides followed by uh, these factors and other minor reasons are in adequate infrastructure, industrial waste and insufficient refinement systems and unqualified personnel. So uh, this survey was done amongst 2050 local units and the Domestic waste came in the first place, according to this uh, chart. And the second chart shows the lack of high quality refinement in cities uh, is a big problem for factories. And Burju will talk about the other statistics. And uh, we can see uh, in this chart that uh, water pollution is the first priority amongst the other environmental problems in Turkey uh, with the percentage of 33. Uh, and, and in this chart uh, we can uh, see that prior, uh, priority order of water pollution in different uh, cities are like that. Um, and uh, in a healthy water source uh, there is ecological ba balance. Uh, domestic and industrial pollution causes this balance to corrupt. Uh, in order to keep the balance, pollutants should be refined from the source. Uh, as we all know, uh, when it comes to environmental problems, uh, the best solution is preventing the problem. Uh, preventing water pollution usually works better and costs less than trying to clean it up. Uh, in order to prevent it, there are some important precautions that can be uh, taken. Uh, especially government uh, plays a big role he uh, here. Uh, the precautions are uh, improving sewer system, uh, inspection, uh, sufficient impact inspection by authorities, uh, refinement, uh, providing refinement for industrial waste, uh, providing inhibition for overusage of agriculture pesticide, uh, for stating and raising awareness. Uh, and now Ipek uh, is going to continue. Yes, in order to prevent contamination, we can also suggest reusing and recycling the uh, treated wastewater can be a good idea. And also raising the prices can 
uh, be a good idea because we are using our available fresh water unsustainably by waste, wasting and polluting the uh, environment and charging too little for it. And this source is irre irreplaceable. So uh, we can recycle it, reuse it, find substitutes for the toxic pollutants, work with natural material instead of, instead of chemical and reduce air pollution will also contribute so much because they are all connected to each other and reduce the population growth, make it slow down would make so much uh, make it so much better and, and uh, at last we, uh, we uh, I, uh, I want to mention uh, what can we do uh, for this uh, situation uh, instead of inorganic fertilizers, uh, fertilizers use natural manure uh, minimize the use of pesticides uh, you can also grow or buy organic food uh, and compost your food waste uh, do not use water fresheners uh, and do not flush unwanted material uh, down the toilet. Uh, do not pour harm chemi chemicals uh, down the dra uh, drain or onto the ground. And uh, that's all uh, we can say about the yes, problem. There are lots uh, of things that government can do and as well as individuals. And we, if we do these things that Burju mentioned, it can do lots of good for the environment. Yes, I agree with you. <laughs> and uh, that's it, I think. Yeah, that was all our presentation. Uh, I want to <laughs> thank you uh, for helping me uh, while preparing this poster and this colorful vision. <laughs> I also want to thank you for waking me up <laughs> early in the morning and trying to uh, make me work. <laughs> yes, it was hard. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for your patience. Also, thank you. <laughs> and thanks for listening to us. Yes. And thanks for teaching us <laughs> all this year. We won't see you again, maybe, but <laughs> maybe we see you around in the campus. So, bye. Bye. <laughs>